Hello and welcome to Michelle's Life on Repeat in my grill room again. I am finishing up my watering and I came across a couple of plants that are doing something. So let's take a peek. These are my Epicatalea lime sherbet. She just bloomed for me a few months ago. Look at that. I have four new buds ready to open up. Epicatalea lime sherbet crossed with Brassavola nodosa. She is doing her thing, just got watered. She has her roots growing. She is happy on the second shelf underneath the Mars Hydro light. There are the bigger plants shading it above it and she gets light that comes through the shelves and she is so excited. Now I show that it was back in October that she bloomed for me. It is February, February, like the beginning of February. So she just like does not want to slow down. She's going to prove herself and she has a beautiful lemony lime colored flower. I'm excited about her. Two more I want to show you today just for a quick little update. Sitting right next to her on the shelf is my Brassavola cordata, the Jamaican species. And I think I got this from Yoshi. Yep, it says Yoshi on the back. And I got her in flower, in bud and flower, back in December. So we're talking just a few months ago. And here she is growing a new shoot for us. I am so excited. Now the blooms didn't last too long for me, I think because of the transit. Um, they didn't ever really fully open. They just kind of stayed halfway and then they wilted and then they died after a few weeks. So I am excited to see her do her thing all over again. She is in a tiny little pot. She's not that big of a plant. Brassavola cordata. She is a species plant. And thirdly, I have one that I purchased one of my first um, years of purchasing plants. And um, she has been on the top shelf for a long time doing life very slowly in a LECA. And I, um, back in January of this year, I took her out of the LECA because she was growing, but very slowly and put her into a full bark, mostly full bark, just got doused with water. So if it looks soggy wet, it is. She's got to dry out. She is an STLMA, which I can never remember what that is. Kelly Lee. I don't believe I've ever seen her flowers. So maybe this year will be the year that I will see the flowers. And I'll put up on the screen what the STLMA stands for. And the name changes so frequently, who knows what the new names will be. But she's got a lot of healthy green going on and she just hasn't had a spotlight for a while. So here she is telling herself and telling the world, I'm still alive, still doing my thing. And I'll show a picture of what her flowers should look like whenever we do see them. That was it, an update of three, and I appreciate your time today, and I wish you wellness and peace, and until we talk again, bye-bye.